And this we hear, we have a fireworm in his natural habitat. Yeah, that's weird. <laughs> What is up, Chrisley Bears? It's your boy Chrisley from Chrisley Trick Shots here. Welcome back to another video. I've been waiting for this vlog for a long time, and now it is time for the 4th of July vlog of 2024. Today is currently July 3rd on a, th on a Wednesday, and uh, I'm out here outside lighting fireworks with some of my friends, and you know, it's gonna be a good time. So my plan for this vlog is to wake up, go to Princeton to watch the fireworks with some of my friends, and hopefully have a good time celebrating the 4th of July together. I'll let you guys hang out with me throughout the whole 4th of July, and it's gonna be awesome. If you guys are excited about today's 4th of July vlog, you might wanna go down below and drop some likes on the vlog. Let's see if this vlog can reach up to 10 likes, so smash that freaking like button baby also if you guys are brand new here to the youtube channel you might want to go down below and click that red subscribe button and a notification bell it signs you up it's free and easy it locks you in to see more videos of me i upload trick shot videos vlogs skits gaming videos and other stuff that i love to do and i upload these long form videos once a week plus i upload shorts randomly so yeah all right without further ado guys let's celebrate the 4th of july together shall we all right first off we have a smoke ball but it's not only a smoke ball, sis. So do the honors of lighting it. Somebody can hold it. At least oh, someone's gonna light don't, it. Don't, don't torpedo me. Please don't torpedo me. <laughs> Chris, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna be moving out of the way here. Go. Watch what it does. Yeah! <laughs> right into the garden. It just... Yeah, it's a ball-shaped firecracker. That's all it is at that point. <laughs> all right, guys, so one of my fans on my TikTok asked me to show off a tank firework, so this is one of them. And I have three firework tanks ready for disposal for the 4th of July, so... And some of y'all wanted me to light the tank fireworks inside my house, and I was like, heck no, I don't want to commit arson. Heck no. So we're just going to light these outside safely, and yeah, let's see how... It goes. I mean, the tank didn't move, but it shot out some fireworks, so... Yeah, some of the tank fireworks vary to see if some of them move or not. So we have three of these fireworks. This is the only, this is one tank firework. We'll show you the other two in a little bit. All right, tank firework number two. Here we go. Stepping back for my own safety. Oh, that didn't move much. I feel like that tank right there moved like a centimeter. But other than that, and it varies on which firework tank you have, because it varies on the movement, I think. But yeah, there's a firework tank number two. Still going out, and it's out. Okay. All right, guys, tank firework number trace, which is the final firework tank that we have. Sis, light it. All right, scooting back. See how it does. Same like the other one, it just moved an inch, or a centimeter. Very colorful to say the least, so... Yeah, these firework tanks depend on the brand, I'd say. Sometimes they move an inch, sometimes they don't, but it's all part of the 4th of July fun, if you know what I'm saying here. Alright, y'all, it's, it's fountain time, let's get it. Let's get it! Oh, yeah. Oh, heck yes. Nice couple seconds of fountain. I love it. Yeah! Woo! Yeah! Fountains, baby! <laughs> More firework fountains brought to you by, by my sister. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's nice. It's very satisfying to get these fountains and just shoot them off and 
have a great time with those. All right, guys, I just got out of the shower right now. I'm ready for bed. Right now is currently 11.45 p.m. where I live right now. And uh, off camera, I just, we just shoot off tiny fireworks, you know, the fountains and the other stuff. We light off fireworks with my sister and her friends tonight. It, it was fun to say the least. And uh, I haven't explained what we're gonna do throughout the rest of this vlog. So I've been filming these 4th of, of July vlogs since 2019. And since then, it's become a tradition on my channel. And I, I would love to keep this tradition going, guys. You guys love them. I keep doing them. This has been a fun tradition so far, celebrating America's freedom. And that's what we all do here. So relax, hang out with me throughout the 4th of July vlog. It's going to be an awesome time. So yeah, I just got out of the shower, got in my PJs, and I'm ready for tomorrow. So yeah, I'm just going to do every transition that I do on every 4th of July vlog. I snap into my 4th of July attire. So when I snap my fingers, it's going to be July 4th. Here we go. Ah, yes, it is now Thursday, July 4th, America's Independence Day. Let's freaking go. As you can see, I'm in my 4th of July attire on. I got my USA shirt and some shorts because it's summer outside and it, I need to wear shorts because they feel comfortable in the warmer months. So heck yes to that. Right now it is currently 11.33 a.m. right now. And I'm just chilling here. I already ate my breakfast of sausage biscuits, which are great. And now I'm just going to be relaxing here. And later on today, my good friend Jacob Farley is going to come over and hang out with me. Whether we're going to play some video games, do all sorts of stuff, maybe relax and edit some videos. And uh, yeah, so stay tuned for when Jacob gets here, I guess. So I'll see y'all then. All right, guess who showed up? Boy, mind Jacob Farley, what's up, my guy? And, and I, 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 I'm gonna say oi in every video with Chris now, because I think I said that in the last one. Pretty much. So Jacob's here, he's hanging out with me. We're gonna do some stuff later on in the vlog, so... I don't know what we're gonna do now. Hopefully we could just chill for like a little bit, maybe play video yeah. games or something like that. Yeah, so change my name from mine dude to chill dude. No, I'm joking. <laughs> so Jacob's here, we're just chilling out, just chatting about some stuff, and... <laughs> Hopefully later on in this vlog we'll do something, so stay tuned for that. Alright guys, so off camera we just played some Mario Kart 8, and now we're going to do the 4th of July Q&A. This is part one of our 4th of July Q&A segment, where a lot of you guys asked me a bunch of questions, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to read five questions from my YouTube community post, and I'm, I'm going to read the questions from the questions you guys asked me on TikTok as well. So let's start off with the YouTube questions and Jacob which trick shot channel has been your biggest inspiration this was from 979 boys and what trick shot channel has been your biggest inspiration Sam Tabor and Ryan Bracken those two guys are the kings of trick shots I've also watched a lot of trick shot youtubers do perfect tricksters that'll work and a bunch of other trick shot youtubers but I say Sam Tabor and Ryan Bracken are my biggest inspirations when it comes to trick shots, so there's that. What inspired you to start trick shots? That's from the trick shot goat. Uh, what inspired me to start trick shots? I just watch a watch videos from Sam Tabor and Ryan Bracken. Again, those two dudes have inspired to what helped me grow on my YouTube channel in the first place. Yeah. Okay. Trick shots has been one of my go-to subjects on this channel, and I also just upload like vlogs, skits, gaming videos, and other stuff that I love to do, and, uh, what inspired me to do trick shots? Sam Tabor and Ryan Bracken, like I said in the previous question, so. Yeah, and I can't really say much about any of this. Because I, most of these questions are, a, are, you guys are asking me, not a bunch of my friends, because yeah. they're mostly not here yet, but yeah. they will get here eventually throughout this vlog, so stay tuned. Yeah, for that. and also, I'm not really a trick shot person. Even with skateboarding, I just ride around. Do just ride tricks. around do tricks. <laughs> well, I don't really do tricks. I just ride around. Like how people ride bikes. What's your favorite trick shot that you've done and that other people have done? This is from Amazing T. Uh, you guys have seen a video where I recreated a bunch of you trick shot YouTubers trick shots. I did a bunch of these. Uh, the few that comes to mind was I did Vortex trick shots, cap flip onto the Rubik's Cube. And I also did boss levels, cup flip from the top of the stairs and into another cup. 
to name a few that other people have done that I've recreated. So I think those are those two are my favorite trick shots I've recreated from a bunch of people. So yeah, hopefully that answers your question. <laughs> what is the most amount of trick shots you ever done in one day? From my boy Reese, aka Plenty of Trick Shots. Uh, the most amount of trick shots I ever done in one day. Uh, depends on the very styles of trick shot videos that I've done. Uh. Whether it's like when the videos where I show you how many attempts each trick shot takes, uh, I mostly did it around about like four or five trick shots in that style of video. But sometimes when I feel like the dude perfect style of trick shot videos where you have to show like the make every time, uh, I might fit in that dude perfect style of video, I might fit like seven to ten trick shots in that video, I would say, so. Yeah. What is your longest trick shot? This is the last question from YouTube community post from That Is Crazy. I still think my paper football, flicking the paper football into the fork, that took me the longest. It took me like four days to complete that shot. I was doing TikTok live streams and that was during the Christmas of 2023, which was last year. Yeah, that's longer than my attention span. <laughs> true <laughs> too true okay we're moving on to the tiktok questions now and the first one comes from james marvin how long have you been rocking the mustache for a few years yeah um i was inspired by ryan bracken to grow out a mustache and i was like you know what i would absolutely rock rock with a mustache yeah and i'm actually growing a beard right now but i would kind of look stupid with a beard anyway yeah and i can actually answer this because i'm also a dude um so, I have had this mustache and beard for quite a while, like, probably, maybe since I was, like, 17 or something, so... Yeah, we have had our mustaches for, like, a few years. What's your favorite trick shot you've completed so far? From Joshi. Um, definitely the one where I threw this and I hooked it on my other tripod, which you can see off camera. So, I threw this onto that tripod right there and uh it banked off of the two walls and onto that which is ridiculous that's one of my favorite trick shots i've completed this far top five hardest trick shot top five hardest trick shots uh definitely the paper football one um the double marker flip that took like 800 attempts the marker in a bottle trick shot where i flipped a marker into a bottle that took forever the Nerf gun trick shot where I ricocheted off of the wall and bounced off of the table and into the tiny cup. That's a hard trick shot. And definitely the pan bounce shots where the trick shot didn't take long, but the setup took longer than the actual shot itself. So definitely the pan shots were like one of my hardest ones yet. Not because of the trick shot, it's because of the setup. What made you stop trick shotting any aspirations? So, like I said in the previous questions, I watched Sam Tabor and Ryan Bracken do trick shots, which in, which in turn inspired this channel as a whole. I watched many other trick shot YouTubers, but I mainly watch Sam Tabor and Ryan Bracken because those two dudes are awesome at trick shots. Any aspirations and goals? Uh, right now, my big goal right now is to get this YouTube channel to 5,000 subscribers. I don't know how many years that's going to take, but... It's going to be worth it once we reach that goal of 5,000 subscribers. Yeah, and I my, know we can hit it together, guys. Yeah, my goal would probably be 400 subscribers. Get him there, guys. The His goal. YouTube channel is linked in the description. He's also filming a 4th of July yeah. vlog. Get him there. Yup, and the mini goal was 300, so... Did you hit that goal yet? Well, not yet. Not I'm, yet. I'm so close, though. So close to 300. Last question from Zade. How do you stay motivated through longer attempts? I just kept trying the trick shot again, so how I stay motivated, uh, I just think of never give up, never surrender in my head. Or, some people would say, never give up, never what, something like that. What it, What is the saying again? Um... Never back okay. down, never what. That's what it is, I think. Oh, yeah. If I'm saying that meme wrong, I'm so sorry. <laughs> never back down, never what. I have that stuck in my head while I... It's like when I'm doing that cup trick shot, I have to walk walk down and up the stairs constantly. I had to get that workout, but if you have a motivational saying stuck in your head, use that to your advantage when you do a hard trick shot so you can stay motivated and complete that trick shot. Yeah, I really need to learn how to get some motivation. YouTube videos, most likely. Yeah, but yeah, for that. 
Because, I mean, I'm motivated with work, but then I come home and I just don't make YouTube videos, but eh, I'll learn it. And I think that is the last question. Yeah, so this is the end of the part one of our Q&A segment. Uh, we're definitely going to be a part... Going to be a part two somewhere down the line on this vlog as well, so stay tuned yeah. for that. And also, if you guys didn't know, I'm going to upload this vlog on July 5th, which is the day you're watching this vlog right now. We are done with the questions. I think I'm going to edit the rest of this so far, and uh, we're just probably going to chill and uh, do something else for this vlog. I'm not sure what we're going to do, but we're going to do something in this vlog, so yeah. All right, so a few months ago... My mom gave me this for my birthday. This is Evil King Evil Rip and Go Stunt Cycle, where you crank up this thing and it makes him go fast. So what have we did is made a ramp into a bucket type situation, and uh, we're going to see if we can launch him off of the ramp into that bucket way down there. So this is going to be our 4th of July trick shot because... Why no, not, so... Because we also did one on my channel as well. Link's in the description. Check him out. But, do you want to go down there and film me do this? Yeah, sure. Alright, here we go. Ow! I stole my finger! Oh. Oh. Okay, second try. Don't stub my finger and don't miss the ramp, please. It, it missed the ramp again! Come on, man! Oh, I mean, he landed it. I think he landed short. Yeah, that could have been it. That could have been it. So we're going to move the bucket forward a little bit and see what happens. I missed the ramp again. Come on. I love missing the ramp, don't I? Oh, wow. Wow. Okay, new plan, moving it to the right a little bit. We got close, that was good. We just need to dial this in, you ready? Yup. successful trick shot yeah look at it off the ramp in there oh my gosh let me know in the comments down below if you want to see us play with evil can evil ribbon stow cycle more often for a youtube video let me know in the comments down below that was awesome all right guys we have made it to princeton right now and me and jacob got ourselves some mcdonald's i got me some chicken nuggets and french fries and jacob got well, also chicken nuggets and fries. The same thing, and we got drinks. Uh, I got sweet tea. Jacob got Coke. Well, we got Coke. And guess who else showed up? It's been a hot minute. Levi Honaker. <laughs> and you can see why his eyes look different is because one of them... I had to have surgery on. I yeah. Can't. And also, go subscribe to Levi Honaker's YouTube channel. I'll also link that in the description down below. He's not filming right now, but help him get his filming notification. <laughs> Motivation back. I almost said motivation. <laughs> Man, my brain went other directions. Oh my gosh. All right, guys. We just went to the store, got us a bunch of drinks. I got myself a Dr. Pepper, like always, because you guys know I love Dr. Pepper. Jacob yeah. got himself a, a Mountain, Mountain Dew. Dew. Yeah. And let's look what J let's look what Levi has. He bought two Hot Wheels cars, two bags of chips, and, and guess how? And, and guess how much the small bag of Hershey's are. Five bucks! Like a little bag. Like, like, like that big of a bag. At least they're good, though. Yeah, better be. $5. But yeah, we're just hanging out here I'll in the park. I'll play with the Hot Wheel. It's McLaren. Yeah. So we're hanging out here, drinking our drinks, and probably eat our snacks. And yeah, we'll see where this takes us. All right, me and Jacob got our drinks. I got Dr. Pepper. He got Mountain Dew. Cheers, oh, bro. Cheers. I and got cheers to you guys for a happy 4th of July. Cheers. I cheers. Got Let's go. Water. Dang. I should have got water, but no. I can drink a Hershey Kiss. Uh, Woo! That's delicious. That's delicious. Uh, well, I feel left out. All right, so it's currently 9.07 right now. It is getting dark, and some people are shooting off fireworks early. Well, we call it the 
personal fireworks in quotation marks. I call it that. And uh, some shooting off right there, some were shooting off over there, and some are shooting off like somewhere over there. And uh, my boy Dean hasn't even answered me yet. He said he's gonna be on his way, but I don't know where he's at. Chris, you're missing so, the fireworks. I know, I'm not gonna waste my luck. That's fair. All right, so I'll, I'll see y'all when hopefully Dean gets here and we can all do stuff. All right, so I'm gonna take a quick stab at filming fireworks. So, uh, let's see where they at. Hope my luck's better than, yeah, my ho hopefully my luck's better than last year. I'm gonna film over here and uh, hopefully I can get something. Or is it something over there? Blur that. Perfect. Oh, I caught that. I caught that. Hey, you missed that one, I missed it. I got the tiny one in front of me, though. Boy. I'm a man, actually. Get it right. <laughs> oh, gosh. See if there's one over here yet. Or over there. Dude. Well, barely got the end of that firework over there. Uh, oh, oi, I found something over there. Why you say oi? Found him. Why'd you say oi? Oi, mate. I don't know. Yeah, I guess I said oi. Oi, mate. Okay, that's I'll probably all the fireworks. Oh, missed oh. oh! You missed it, loser. There we go, there we go. Hey, I'm zooming in on that up. one. Hey, you missed that one. And that's it. Oh, oh! oh. Oh, those are stupid. Th those are Roman candles. Oh, those are, bl oh, they'll focus, focus, hey. The focus went away. Th the auto focus. Oh, where's that one going? Okay. Sideways. Yep. Oh, it's going up and just went that way. Oh, wait, those are, yep. aren't Roman candles. Those are, uh, whistler things. Whistler things. Hey, you missed that one. That was pretty big. Oh. The speed of sound to the speed of light is crazy. Oh, hey. barely got that one with a voice crack. Alright, I'm gonna move my seat. There are some fireworks going way behind the trees over there. I see them. Hey. There you go. You have it. Uh, oh, God. Well, Shoot. Pig old fart. Well, I think that's all the fireworks I'm gonna film today. Alright, guys, the Princeton Fireworks Show has begun. Look at that. Oh, yes. That's a big boy. Me and Jacob's getting the heroic shots. Look at that. Perfect. Oh my gosh. Yeah, we're filming them. We're filming the fireworks. Let's go. <laughs> That's a thumbnail. More Princeton's fireworks coming at you. I'd laugh if they all stopped. Oh, those are pretty cool. Oh, those are cool. I like the big ones that make a really loud thing. I know, dude. <laughs> those are the best, Boom. I know. Oh. Oh, yes. Why is there a truck just now pulling in? I don't know. <laughs> See, big boom. I like those. The big boomies? The big boom boom. Boom booms? Like the enemy in yes. Super Mario? Yes. Wow, okay. This is how we celebrate beating a country and becoming our own. Heck yeah. Uh, celebrate our freedom. Oh, oh gosh. Cool. Oh, these are cool, dude. That's cool. More of the fireworks going on, boys. Let me just zoom in. There we go. Oh, yeah. Woo! Yeah, dude. Hang on. I have a phone call while I'm filming fireworks. Hang on. Okay, sorry about that. Uh, about my crappy filming of fireworks. There we go. I'm talking to one of my sister's friends on the phone right now while I was watching fireworks earlier, so... Sorry about that. Yeah, 
Look at that heroic shot of Jacob filming fireworks. Ain't that glorious? Whoa! Colorful! Sorry about the long wait, folks. Uh, I had to find one of my sister's friends, and now I'm back filming fireworks. This has been a very chaotic episode of the 4th of July vlog of 2024, but it's all good. Ah, yes. These look so cool, dude. These look so cool. Yeah, dude. I mean, we was going to film a part two of the Q&A segment, but unfortunately, Dean Brenlinger has, is not here to watch the fireworks with us, but he's on a different spot where he watches fireworks, so... If y'all want to subscribe to Dean Ling, then what? What am I saying? If you guys want to subscribe to Dean Brandlinger's YouTube channel, his his channel links are in the description below. Yeah, and I'll actually link his channel in my description as well because, well, you said that here as well. Basically, yeah. So subscribe to Dean Brandlinger and Spirit. His channel is linked in the description. So, without wasting time on fireworks, let's continue. More fireworks to come on this awesome 4th of July vlog of mine. Yellow or gold? Red? I'm just going to say all the firework colors. Yellow slash gold again. Red again. Yellow again. That time was just a big boom. Oh, now it's gone to green now. Oh, Christmas colors. Hello. Hello. I'm just being chaotic today. I am hope you guys... Sorry about me being chaotic, but that's who I really am when I film these YouTube videos. Wow. <laughs> that guy screaming right behind me. Boom. Dude, these look sick. Look up Jacob's joyous face when he films the fireworks. Yep. Oh! There they go. Some fireworks love to blend in with each other, I would say. Wow. Whoa! Hello! <laughs> Uh-oh. Look what's, look what's coming. Rapid fire. Rapid fire. Is this the finale, I think? Oh. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. If it's the grand finale, they could be rapid firing all these at once. Whoa! Yeah! Whoa! Whoa! Oh my gosh! Woo that my was guns. awesome! And there's a tiny firework over there to finish it off with another voice crack! Yeah. <laughs> and with that. That is the end of the Princeton Fireworks Show. Jacob, yeah. how did you rate this? Well, I probably rate it, well, 10 out of 10, probably. 10 out of 10. Best show of the year. Yeah, Heck, I yes. It might have been better than last year's, probably. So. Heck, yeah, it is. I didn't film most of it, but you guys saw the firework part of it, so that's good. All right, so that was the firework show of 2024. Me and Jacob had a blast watching yeah, this, filming did. it all, and... We both have 4th July vlogs coming out. Probably tomorrow, I think, when we're yeah. going to upload these. So as you guys are seeing, when this, when my 4th July video goes up on July 5th, he's going to be uploading his on the same day. Yeah, most likely. So if you are watching this video on July 5th, then go to Jacob Farley's channel. Link's in the description to watch his perspective of his 4th July vlog coming out yep. pretty soon. Yep. And uh, yeah, so now we're going to hop into... Jacob's car and yeah. probably head back to my house.
yeah. where this vlog started. So I'll see y'all back in my house. All right, guys, to make up for my neighbor Levi leaving and Dean Brenlinger not joining us to watch the fireworks, we're gonna do part two of the Q&A segment to make it up for you guys. So let's start off with the first question from It's Natural. And it says, what's your favorite video game? My favorite video game would obviously have to be Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. And Jacob, what's your favorite video game? Um, probably, uh, maybe Resident Evil, the series. That, that's pretty cool. Oh, okay. Next question from the Trick Shot Goat. What's your favorite color? My favorite color is yellow. Jacob, what's your favorite color? Green. Green? Okay. This next question comes from T2K. And the question says, my question for all of you, which celebrity from fiction or nonfiction would you rel relate yourself and why? Uh, the nonfiction character, uh, the fiction character I, I might relate to myself to is uh, probably Bowser from Super Mario. Because I get chaotic and crazy when I film these uh, YouTube videos. And so, Jacob, which celebrity from fiction or nonfiction would you relate yourself and why? Probably Yoshi, because I'm a Giga Chad, just like Yoshi. We're just named yeah. Nintendo characters because we can't yeah. think of celebrities, so yeah. video game characters it is. Okay, you can barely see me in this one. This one's from Mike Micaiah War Worrell, Michael Jordan, or LeBron James. For me, it's it's has to be Michael Jordan 100%. And what about you, Jacob? Michael Jordan or LeBron James? Well, I don't really pay attention to basketball because, well... Yeah, you don't watch a lot of sports? Yeah, I don't. Okay, no. okay, that's reasonable. Yeah, that's reasonable. Yeah, because I'm lazy. Next question from Jerry Fish. What sort of shirts do you think are the best kind of shirts? Well, for me, it depends on, on whether the weather is warm or not or not warm. So, in warm weather, I choose uh, t-shirts for warm weather. And for cold weather, for me, it has to be a long, long sleeve shirts and hoodies. Well, I mean, I don't really have that much of a sense of style necessarily, but I guess the best kinds of shirts are like ones of characters and stuff, because I like that. Oh, okay. I just like that. Okay, that's reasonable. All right, last question of the Q&A comes from KK the KO, and that person asked, are, are there any secret skills you have? Uh... I think it's not most likely the secret skill of mine. I do trick shot videos. I make trick shots, so that's my skill. And what is your secret skill? Um, probably making YouTube videos. It's not really a secret skill. It's just a skill that both of us have in common. Both oh, yeah, making YouTube not, videos. Oh, yeah, not secret, but yeah. Yeah. All right, guys, we have made it back to where this vlog originally started. My house. And uh, Jacob is about to leave soon, so... Yeah. So how did you like the Princeton's fireworks so far? It was awesome. Better than last year. Heck yes, dude. And it's been an awesome time just hanging out with my friends and hanging out with you guys while yep. we watched fireworks together, and it was an awesome time. Yeah. Well, it's about the same time to say goodbye to Jacob Harley because he's going to yeah. go back at his house to finish up his 4th of July vlog. Yep. But before we say goodbye to each other, we're going to do a goodbye handshake. All right, see ya, Jacob. Yeah. Subscribe to Jacob's channel, guys. Link's in the description. And that is going to end the 4th of July vlog of 2024. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you did, click the thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, and click the notification bell so that way you'll never miss out on my future videos. Go subscribe to my friends' YouTube channels. Their links are in the description down below. Share this video with your friends. Comment down below what video should I upload next. And also go follow my social medias. I'll link those in the description down below as well. And yeah, guys, that's all I have to say. Till next time, Chrisley Bears. Have a nice, happy, and safe 4th of July. Peace!